Vero and Nora that are going to teach you how to make this new kit soap. And we have our materials. We have water, nitro soap, light ash, flex and plum, sulfonic, SLS, foam booster, STPP, dusty, preservative, then our color and fragrance. So first of all, measure our water into a big bowl. Finally, add our nitro soap. Be careful not to make it too much so that it will not form lumps. You can see what I'm doing. And see it's sticking in so it keeps turning if it's too thick you can add more water again to the quantity we are using before so now we are going to dissolve our light ash so just measure out your water first then you add this is our light ash as you can see the light ash is dissolved well we are going to add it to our nitro so and then stay stay very well So this is our text upon. We are going to mix it with our sulfonic together first before we add it to the to the nitro so and light ash. Our sulfonic. As you can see how it's looking. Sometimes it might not be thick like this, but don't be scared, it's still okay. So we're going to add this mixture to our nitrogen and light ash. Then you stay. very well to mix so we are going to dissolve our SLS with water some of the SLS comes in powdered form 
So maybe you get to the market and they give you the one that is powdered. It's also SLS. They have powdered SLS and the one that looks like, like rice. The SLS takes time to dissolve, so you have to dissolve. Just have to pinch it and dissolve it completely before adding, so that it's not the visible in your liquid soap. So the SLS is completely dissolved, as you can see. So we are going to add it to our bowl. That is containing text upon sulfonic, nitroso, and light ash. to add our foam booster now. Please always remember to stir very well once you add. our STPP. We are going to dissolve it with a little water again. Dissolve complete and stay. This is our caustic soda. We are going to dissolve it. So you have to be careful with your caustic soda. So we are adding the caustic soda to it. So if your product is too thick, you cannot add extra water, but be careful not to overpower water. As you can see, this one is very thick. And we're going to add water. We are adding our preservative to it. And stay. So now we are going to dissolve our color. Oil-based and water-based color. We are making use of water-based color. So you use water to dissolve. When you buy the oil-based color, you use oil to dissolve. But since you're not making use of any oil in our pro in our pro products, we're going to use water-based color. So it dissolves it. This is green color. You can use any color of your choice, and then to your taste too. Don't forget to like our page and then drop your comments on the comment box if there is any confusion you are having. Then lastly, we are going to add our fragrance of your choice. Any fragrance of your choice. You have different fragrance in the market with different prices. So you stay very well. Now your 
product is complete but then you have to leave it for at least 24 hours so that every chemical that we use there will not be harsh again in our skin when we are washing so you leave it to dissolve to calm down for at least 24 hours before making use of it so remember to like our page comment and share thank you very much Please don't forget to like, share, and comment.